I'm Robert Marcelli, Director of Public Works for the City of College Park. And today we're conducting our dry run uh, snow removal operation, which is a training exercise for all of our Public Works staff. Uh, right here you'll see one of our heavy plows. This is a six ton dump with a 10 foot plow and a spreader box. It holds about six tons of salt back there. And today's exercise is really for the drivers to get familiar again with driving around with a plow on the front of the truck, to exercise the truck, to, to ride the route and get familiar with the route and locate problem areas and trouble spots that we may need to get a pickup truck into because they can't get into the, those tight streets. Um, so this is Vince Campbell, one of our motor equipment operators. How you doing? He's one of our drivers. This is one of our uh, heavy plows again. Back here you'll see we have a spreader area where we where we distribute the uh, salt, sodium chloride, and we have the ability to pre-wet it with those saddle tanks right there. We could use um, salt brine or some mag chloride or any other type of product to wet the salt, which will allow the salt to stick to the road better, melt at lower temperatures. So today they're going out, they're gonna ride all 50 some miles of city streets. They're gonna drive all the streets and we're going to regroup at the end of the dry run and discuss some of the some of the areas that we need to focus on any problems with any of the trucks or any of the equipment we're going to correct uh, before the first snowfall so one of the challenges that our snowplow drivers face in the winter trying to get through all of the streets that we have to service which is all 100 percent of the college park roadways is trying to get through some of these very tight narrow streets. Um, one of the things we would really like the residents to help us with is if you can, park in your driveway, park in your garage, park off the street, and if you have nowhere to park off street, park as close to the curb as possible so that our trucks can navigate down the street um, without you know, having cars parked out into the travel lane somewhat. If you could park, uh, you know, tight to the curb, that's what we would really like some help with from the residents.